Grenada continues to see a spike in its dengue fever cases, recording 16 for January 2021 alone. In an exclusive interview with permanent secretary in the Ministry of Health, Dr. Francis Martin, these numbers are high as in previous years, they have recorded as low as zero cases. He says the number of cases for 2020 and 2021 continues to alarm the health authorities on island. The numbers that we're seeing with dengue fever is still higher than what is normally expected um, at this time of the year, traditionally. It is not as high as it was in the peak of the spike that we experienced last year, but it is still high enough to become of epidemiological concern for us. It, the concern is even more because as we head into the dry season, people tend to store water a lot more. And for that reason, the potential risk still exists and still increases. Um, but fortunately, we are doing very well in terms of our management. Um, and we have not seen any serious complications. Recognizing that other Caribbean countries have also been affected by the disease, Dr. Martin explains that this is because persons are not cleaning around their homes, leaving a healthy breeding ground for the Aedes aegypti mosquito. There's only one way we can actually stop the spread of dengue, and that is to decrease the breeding size of the ve vector. As long as people continue to disregard uh, the mosquitoes and disregard the breeding places for mosquitoes and disregard cleanliness and continue to dump inappropriately, continue to have uncovered waters in their surroundings, then I'm afraid our country will never see um, a decrease in the spike in dengue. Presently, the Ministry of Health is heightening awareness for dengue fever on the island. Um, the campaign against it has started, is continuing, and will be ramped up as the weeks go by. We're also going to be increasing our vector control mechanisms and processes over the, over the next coming weeks. We must not rely on fogging for controlling of dengue. Fogging only knocks down the adult mosquitoes, and it only does it for a couple of days. It's still dependent on people and human behavior to do what we need to do. To prevent the spread of dengue. The permanent secretary says that while the number of cases recorded for the year is not as much as 2020, it is still an alarming amount to be concerned about. For GBN News, I am Rina Peh reporting.